goal setting. It's such an important topic when it comes to financial planning and oftentimes missed, is missed actually, when we sit down with families. Common example would be we have individuals or families that want to talk to Aaron and I or our team of advisors about investing or about tax planning. And oftentimes we have to take a step back and remind them that at the end of the day, we have to approach this from the lens of what goals you want to achieve. Because at the end of the day, we don't want families siloing their financial decisions, um, investing here, estate planning here. The whole operation has to, has to work in unison. And sorry for the farm example for those that may be watching from the coasts. We're here in the Midwest where farming is a big deal. But getting back to what we're discussing in the goal setting is that if we don't know what goals you're trying to achieve, all the financial tools in the world will not help you get to your destination because you don't know where to start. So Aaron, talk us through how you want to approach goal setting and some of the important things you need to be thinking about when setting those goals. Yeah, we want to uh, start really with the end in mind. And so you want to know where you're going so you have a path to get there. And uh, we tell people all the time, your situation's unique and it's not a cookie cutter approach where one size fits all. So understanding that you're unique, your goals are unique and really planning with the end in mind helps us to craft and create a plan to make sure that you're hitting your financial journey. And so goal setting is important because it allows us to know your destination, kind of that beacon point of what we're trying to hit. And it helps us put strategies in place to cover all of the things that you just talked about uh, in the opening, like estate planning, tax planning. So we know how to help accomplish and help you get to the, that destination. Absolutely. So Aaron's right on the money here, and no pun intended. And at the end of the day, if you don't know where you're trying to go, remember, there's not a tool in the world that anyone has access to that'll help you get there. So remember, start with where are you wanting to achieve, what journey are you wanting to be on, and so that you can start setting some of those landmark goals in place in your plan to get to the, the destination you're looking to uh, get to. So thank you for watching. Hope this content was valuable today. We'll see you at the next one. If you're interested in more content, please click the link above. If you're interested where you stand personally, please click the link below and you can create a profile and a member of our team will reach out to talk about where you stand within the five critical elements on your financial journey.